Venezuelan migrant is describing con some conditions he experienced while inside a detention center right here in El Paso. 21-year-old Anderson Amaya Blanco says as of a young father of two children, he had no choice but to try to make it to the U.S. to provide for them. He was one of many to turn themselves in to border authorities during an enforcement action a couple days before the expiration of Title 42. Blanco shows off the array of bracelets he received during his four days in detention, a yellow one noting his vaccination against COVID-19. Food he was given included a burrito, an orange, and a bottle of water. Blanco says the detention facility felt like a jail as he spent time in a holding pen with more than 400 other men. On Friday, his name was called not for a deportation flight, but instead to be given a permit and papers and told he was free to travel in the U.S. Blanco will have to show up for immigration court dates. Until then, he says he will likely sleep near El Paso Sacred Heart Church until he can come up with a plan.